graduating and noggin. <laughs> Dory. Hey, Dory. I got you in your noggin. I got you in your noggin. Say, we're live. We got dog. Here, back up. Do you don't have to be in my face? My boy, how do? How do? I don't even know if everybody can see you when you're that close to me. I don't even know what's going on. Cameras are breaking. Don't touch that camera or it'll all be over. Don't. Here, sit. Sit. Say your butt. Sit on your butt. Sit. Sit, sit, sit. Thank you. Give me your paw. Oh, thanks. Oh, it's nice to see you. I only get once. Can I have it again? One time and one time only, apparently. All right. Let's see if we can set this up so I can actually see my chat and see what's going on. Because right now, I don't have any idea what's going on. Let's see if we can switch to this camera. Hold on. Let's see if we got this. There we go. I got a little bit up closer camera. How's that look? Okay, let's see if I can uh, see what's going on in the chat. I have no idea. Okay. Something's going off over here. All right, cool. Can you guys hear me? I don't know if you can even, I don't like I said, I don't know what's going on right now because uh, I don't have the chat open just yet. You do see some dogs. That's a good thing. Let me see if I can get this chat to open back up on this. And then we'll go, hey, guys, hi, how are you? Welcome back to uh, Gone to the Snow Dogs, where we show you what life with your dog can and should be like. The reality of it is where we show you how to not operate a live stream because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, but we will figure this out. Kira is in full on let's play with everything mode and let's just be a dog and be crazy. She's pretty good at that if you if you didn't know. Uh, right before I set this up my camera decided to fail so I had to switch cameras. Hopefully y'all can hear me. I got my microphone down here. Got the dogs over here. Memphis has dirt. Look at on the side of her face. She's got a whole bunch of dirt on the side of her face. Oh my goodness. Okay let's see here. Oh, I think I got it. I think I, I think I got my little, my little thing here. It looks like we got a super chat from Helen. Hello, Helen, and thank you for the super chat. All right, so my plan was to have this. I don't know if you guys can see this. My cute little, my cute little computer. So my plan was to have my cute little computer down here in front of me so that I could, like, see the chat and see what's going on. And I think it's going to work. Sweet. If it, if it doesn't lag a whole bunch, so we'll see. We'll see what it's doing. Dun, dun, dun. Welcome, guys. We haven't done a live stream in a really long time. I thought it would just be fun to get on here and kind of see what's going on with you guys. The dogs are going to enjoy their dinner and possibly a bully stick as well. Um, before we get too far, Zuma, thank you for the super chat. Zuma says, I love all of your videos, and I just got a new horse. Zuma, that's amazing, and I miss you. I met Zuma in New York. She met the dogs. M Mimi also sent a super chat that says, how's it going? Well, it's, um, let's just say it's going. <laughs> uh, for some reason, my laptop doesn't want to be a laptop right now. Oh, I got it. I got it. I got it. I fixed it. I did it. Yay. Okay, so let me make sure that I got all these super chats real quick. Geo says, hi guys, love your videos so much. Nova the Husky says, hi, she's a huge fan. Stay positive and dream big. Oh, that is what I am trying to do tonight, my friends. Moonwolf473, thank you for the super chat as well. Oh my goodness. See, my laptop doesn't want to be my friend today. So this, here, let me try that. There we go do that one more time. Oh, there. Now I can actually see everything. Cool. All right. Okay. Holy cow. There are so many of you guys in the chat right now. I know lots of you guys have questions and lots of you guys want to ask things. Um, not that you have to, but one of the easiest ways, of course, is the super chats because it kind of makes it pop up so I can actually see it. But please go ahead and post your, your uh, questions and stuff down in the chat. I'll try to answer as 
many as I possibly can. As you guys can see, the chat kind of flies by, and it's a little bit hard to keep up. Big shout out to my friend Dan. If you guys don't know who Dan is, he is the moderator down in the chat. He has his own channel at youtube.com slash rfsdan. He does trivia. I guess there might be a Snow Dogs trivia coming up on his channel. I don't know. If you guys want to see that, comment and let me know if you would like us to do a trivia video based on the dogs. I think that could be a lot of fun. Rosa, thank you for the super chat. So happy to see you guys. Love how Kira loves to jump and swim in the pool. She has gotten so big and fearless. Have you taught her to pull with your bike yet? And what about agility? We have done a little bit with Kira on the bike so far. Let me tilt this down a little bit more. Can we see her? Can we see her pretty little face now? Oh, that's the wrong camera. Here, wait. Don't turn off. Okay? Wrong thing. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I got this. Ready? Don't turn off. Don't turn off. Yay, we did it. Okay. Um, back to Rosa's question. Uh, she has done a little bit with the bike. She's not very fearful of it, so it's been a little bit difficult to teach her how to do the bike. And we have done a little bit with agility, but not a ton. Um, doggy Vlogs, thank you for the super chat as well. Okay, let's see here. I think I got all the super chats that are up here. And yes, we do. All right. How did you give her the name Kira? For those of you that don't know, Kira is actually named after one of the characters in my favorite movie of all time, which is The Dark Crystal. And she is named Kira after the Gelfling in The Dark Crystal. Loki, I see you down there. Thank you for the super chat as well. Kevin, thank you for the super chat. Slow mode is actually on, believe it or not. Like, yeah, this is this is just how these uh how these tend to go. So, Crystal Din says, thank you for the super chat. Says we lost our husky in February. Oh, that is that's never a fun thing to have to go through. Okay, these dogs need to eat some dinner. As you can tell, they're kind of a little bit uh, a little bit laying down, a little bit lazy here. A little bit lazy there, girls. Would you like some? Uh, would you like some food? Are you hungry? So we thought we would do something a little bit different today and a little bit special for their dinner. I know you guys have seen us use these things before, but we are going to feed the dogs today using a snuffle mat. If you've never seen a snuffle mat before, you're gonna see one shortly. Oh, by the way, yes, we are in the new office, so I I, I hope you guys enjoy that as well. Hopefully, we'll be able to do more live streams and fun stuff from in here. I really really hope so. Thank you again to my moderator, Dan. He's trying to make sure that I don't miss any of your super chats because he's awesome. Um, yes, we have nearly 1 million subscribers. There are 700 of you in here. If every one of you could do us a huge favor and hit share and share this video with your friends and let them know, hey, if you love dogs, if you love huskies, if you love adventure, if you love all this fun stuff, Subscribe to the channel. We are less than 25,000 subscribers away from 1 million amazing audience members. Oh my gosh, I can't. Like, I can't even. I can't even, you guys. Oh my gosh. Okay. Kira, are you hungry? Memphis, you have dirt on the side of your face. Memphis, are you hungry? Hey, I'm not kidding. You want to eat in this room? Are you hungry? Oh, I got two little micro head tilts. Are you hungry? Would you like to eat some food? Okay, I'm gonna feed you on your snuffle mats and I'm gonna try to look at this camera and make sure that I get each of you on a side. I think we can do this. I think we got this. All right, let me grab their food. So if I don't answer your questions for a minute, that's why we're gonna, well, yeah, I know we're gonna get you food. I brought food in here. You didn't even know there was food in here. Oh my goodness. Okay, come over here. Don't knock my computer down. All right, first, let's set this down. First, let's set up your snuffle mats. So like I said, if you guys have never seen a snuffle mat before, this is what it is. And basically, Memphis moves your fluffy butt. It makes it so the dogs kind of have to like root for their food. We're gonna make you guys turn the other way because nobody wants to look at your dog butt. <laughs> or maybe they do, I don't know. Okay, we're ready. We're gonna do it this way though. I gotta make sure I know whose foods is whose. Yeah, can you sit? Oh, good job. Can you, can you sit? Can you sit? On your butt. Good job, thank you. Okay, 
All right. No, we can't take it out of there. We gotta go like this. Here, can you come here? Come here. Come here. Thank you. Okay, ready? No, Peppas, you got yours over here. Right? So I pour their food on here and I kind of like move my hands around and really make sure that it's, yeah, I do get dog food all over my hands when I do it. We're gonna turn Memphis around. Memphis, can you turn around? Going. There you go. Good job. All right. Can we see that in the camera? Oh, you guys can totally see that. Look. I'll even pull this one. Here, can we pull your mat this way? Just a little bit. Make it easier for everybody to see you. Sweet. Check that out. Can you see both of them? So, as you can see, they kind of have to work a little bit harder to get that food. This is a really fun game for the dogs. It makes it so that uh, they have to work for their food. Basically, they're foraging is what you would call it. So they are foraging for their food right now. What do you think, huh? Please don't break, please don't break, please don't break. There, is that better? Now you can see, there you go, now you can see both dogs. <laughs> so while they are foraging for their food, <laughs> um, where did I get the mats? Oh, I don't know if I have those on my Amazon list. I have a, um, a kit, which um, Dan or my friend Loki, who is also an amazing moderator. Loki, thank you for moderating. If you guys haven't checked out Loki the Siberian, please do. Um, I don't know if I have the snuffle mats on the kit, but you can find them on Amazon. Somebody sent us these ones. You can also make your own. I thought about doing a video doing a DIY snuffle mat and making them to kind of show you guys how to do it. I thought that would be fun as well. Do you plan on opening any more puppy boxes? Um, eventually. I think eventually we will. <laughs> oh. Thank you guys for posting all of the fun things. Today they are just eating their instinct dog food. It is um, the rabbit. It's instinct rabbit. I do food rotations with my dog, so they don't tend to stay on the same food for a long period of time. I try to switch them out to different high quality foods and I try to switch out their proteins and right now they're on instinct. Dun, 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 dun. How'd you get such unique names for your dogs? We just uh, named them that way, pretty much. <laughs> uh. All right, kitty cat girl doggo says, please say hi to Holly. Hi Holly and thank you for the super chat. Becky Ross says, Jessica, how are you doing? Well. I'm doing better now that the live stream has been started and that things are going better than I expected them to go because my camera messed up right before I started. But you know what? We're past that. We're good. The audio's good. The video's good. The camera's working. If you guys are trying to find a Logitech Brio camera right now during this pandemic, they're almost impossible to find. And I don't know if you guys remember, some of you that have been around for a really long time uh, do probably remember the time we did a live stream and we dropped the camera in the water bowl, uh, it still kind of acts up because of that. So you can see Kira is now digging at her mat. That's funny. Dun, 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 dun. Somebody wants to know how to get a shout out. You got to do super chats for those. Um, what does this say? We're, whoa, I missed it. We're getting ready. For a black lab, do food toppers make a big difference as far as health-wise? Um, you can use food toppers. We do that from time to time, especially when traveling. You can do that. Um, I suggest, you know, just making sure that your dog has a well-rounded meal. Like, my dogs eat kibble, but they also get, you know, fruits and vegetables. They get raw from time to time. And like I said, I kind of rotate out their food. So they really get a big variety of food when they eat. And I think that's kind of more important than the brand of dog food or things like that. Oh, you, you can't, she gonna get you. Here, here, here. Did you get all yours? Are you sure? Here, move your squishy butt. Are you sure it's, are you sure it's all gone? Are you 100%? What if, if I pick this up and shake it, are pieces gonna fall out? Cause you're really bad at leaving pieces behind. <laughs> here, right here. Oh, you did, you did it. You got all of yours. Wow, good job. Good job. Pink Star, thank you for the super chat. Um, what is it like having a husky? Um, huskies are great most of the time. 
<laughs> uh, most of the time. Kiro, just before this, decided that she was going to pull one of my little statues off of a shelf I didn't think she could reach, and she bit the ear off of it before I could get to her. She's actually been destroying a lot of stuff the past few days. She's in her I'm a teenage husky mode. Um, Jenna, oh my gosh! Jenna, what the heck? Thank you for the super chat. You and Jamie and the girls have been a gift to us during these wild times. Glad to be in a position to give that back a bit. Oh my gosh, you're gonna, you're seriously, you're gonna make me cry. <laughs> oh, I know, I should definitely be doing more live streams, especially during the pandemic, but I think, like you guys, I just got this new office set up, look at, look at, I can actually do things from in here, and it, it actually is gonna work. That two, that $200 is gonna be spent on the dogs on our next camping trip. Trust me, trust me. We have, I don't know if I've talked about that yet. Oh, hi, Fluffy. I don't know if I've talked about that a lot on here, but we're going camping next week for three days with my parents, and then in September we're doing a two, uh, seven to ten days to however long we feel like camping trip with some amazing friends of ours and the dogs, and I'm so excited. I'm, I'm so excited. <laughs> Jenna, you're amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you to all of you, literally all of you, to everybody that comments, to everybody that shares our videos, to everybody that's just here. Like, you guys mean more to us than I think I could ever explain. Oh, Kira has the headless, the headless, uh, hi, there's no more over there. There's no more. There's no more. You, okay, you can check hers, but can you move your butt that way? Thanks. Or just walk that way. That works too. See you later. Bye. Where are you going? <laughs> oh, oh, you guys are amazing. You're amazing. So yes, we are going camping again. Are we going to Minnesota? I, I don't know. It's going to be like an unplanned trip. We don't really know where we're going. We're just going to go and get there when we get there and end up where we end up when we get there. Brad, thank you for the super chat. Hello, Memphis and Kira. You guys, Key the Stunt Dog and Sherpa are my faves. Oh, Key and Sherpa. Key's owner is one of my one of my friends. We talk quite often. They're some amazing people. Uh, somebody asked, and I missed it, but Memphis, come here. Somebody asked, when is Kira getting spayed? I think here. Can you go that way a little bit? Thanks. Um, <laughs> oh, the joy of the joy of filming with dogs. Hold on a second here. Let's see if we go to this camera. There. Now we get a little bit more of the heads of the dogs. Right? Can you get away from that camera? Thanks. Um, Kira will be getting spayed in November. Uh, she, we kind of wanted to wait until she was at least a year old, so she's gonna be getting spayed in November. Do you both need water? I think they both need water, and I didn't, I didn't think about that. I didn't bring a bowl of water in here. No, I didn't bring you a bowl of water in here, did I? No, would you like your water? She's like, I ate, I need some water. Okay, hold on, guys. I'm going to let her walk down the hallway and get some water. Yeah, okay, all right, I, I know. All right, I'm going to open. Okay, okay, we're going to get some water. Come on, come on. Go this way. You go get some water. I didn't think about that. Go and then come back, okay? Go get your water. <laughs> uh, while they are doing that, I'll show you guys this real quick. So this is some art that I had sent to us. This is an updated version of Shelby. Those of you that have seen a lot of our vlogs know that we have these paintings hanging in our living room. And the person that did these wanted to send us an updated one of Shelby. But they also sent one of Kira. So I just ordered another frame. So I will have this um, framed and I will hang it in the living room and I don't know if this will show up real well on here but the person that did that is named Shalman Portraits so it's facebook.com slash have it painted or printed but there is their card hopefully that shows up aren't those awesome they're so so stinking cute and the updated one of Miss Shelby Shelby the one I have of Shelby is one of the first paintings she ever did so she wanted to give us a gift and do a new one. Hi, welcome back. Welcome back, back to the show. Okay, I'm gonna put this back real quick. Thanks. Whoops, don't lose this. 
Don't lose that, okay? We got it. Don't lose it. Oh, all right. We're done with the snuffle mats. We're done with the snuffle mats. I don't know what else we got going on here. What else we got going on here? Dun, 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 dun. All right, can you go over there? Hey, can you go over there? Go over there a little bit. Thank you. Uh, Brittany, thank you for the super chat. Do you think that Memphis had some disadvantages from not waiting for her first heat while Kira has had some advantages because she had her first heat? That is actually a really good question. So it's something that we talked about, oh hi, a little bit in the video we did with Kira stating that she hadn't been fixed yet. Wait, hold on, hold on, I gotta switch to this other camera because you, your faces are all, there we go, hi, hi, how are you? Can you go over there a little bit? Thanks. Okay, now I'll put you over here. How's that? Deal. Um, I don't know that necessarily... I mean, there is advantages and disadvantages. Do I think that Mef Memphis suffered anything because she got fixed when she was younger? I don't know. I don't know. I guess we'll, we'll find out as she gets older. Realistically. Hi. Do you still feed them nom nom every once in a while? Yes. As I said a little bit earlier, I do rotate their food. So they do still get the nom nom, the nom nom, nom 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 nom, the nom nom food as well. Can you sit? Yeah, right here. Can you sit? Can you sit? She's like, I don't really want to. I don't really. <laughs> oh, she's like, I ate. Okay. All right. I scooch over here a little bit. There. Look. Look, now you can be in the camera. Look, Memphis, or Memphis, Kira has learned the trick of if I stop petting. Hey, hey, your hand is supposed to go right there. Uh, Stephanie, thank you for the super chat. Marvelous Mutt, oh my goodness, thank you so much. Hey Jess, we're looking at getting a playmate for my Shelby, but not sure if a responsible breeder or a rescue would be the best route with Shelby's blindness. Would love to hear your experience with both a rescue and a breeder. So... This is something that's really, um, it's a hard thing because there's not really like a good, you know, here's the answer, but I'll do what you asked. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll do what you ask and I will, uh, tell you my experience. So as you guys know, sit, honey, sit. Both Kira, hi. Oh, it's nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you. Both Kira and Memphis are from... Thank you, Doggy Vlogs, for the super chat. Are from reputable, responsible breeders. Kira is from Ninkasa Siberians, and Memphis back there is from Highlander Siberians. Both very responsible, reputable breeders. Um, and then Oakley was a rescue. Shelby was her rescue slash a backyard breeder, and Shiloh was a rescue slash a puppy mill puppy that we got from a pet store that they were going to kill. So we've kind of been through it all, and... With your dog having the issues that they have, getting a puppy, for those of you that don't know the Marvelous Mutt, you can follow them on Instagram um, and YouTube, I think. Their dog is having issues going blind. Um, with that being, be, that being said, that the dog is blind and having issues with slowly losing its sight, a puppy might be a little bit much, so you might be better off with a rescue, maybe rescuing an older dog. My experience, I'm really, really happy with the dogs from the responsible, reputable breeders that we've chosen. I, it's a very different experience than a rescue, but at the same time, it's a different feeling. Here, my microphone's behind me. I just realized that. Um, it's a different feeling, but at the same time, like, I, hey, stay there. I feel like, hi. I feel like it's a really personal choice and one that you really have to make on your own. Katie M, thank you for the super chat. That's a hard one. I don't know how to answer it. I love all my dogs. So would I choose a breeder over a rescue? Not necessarily. Would I choose a rescue over a breeder? Not necessarily. What do I think you should do? I don't know. Maybe you can foster through a rescue and see, um, see kind of what what could happen, not what could happen, but how your dog reacts to having another dog in the house not being able to see, that might be an option for you. You are the neediest little thing in the universe right now. Neediest little thing in the universe. Oh, I saw one of my favorite questions. What is your opinion on adopt, don't shop? My opinion on adopt, don't shop is it should be adopt or shop because everybody is different. 
everybody. And nobody should be shamed for getting a dog from a responsible, reputable breeder. And nobody should be shamed for getting a dog from a wonderful rescue. I think both options are viable. And when you buy a dog from a responsible, reputable breeder, you are supporting purpose-driven breeds. Yeah. Yeah. And responsible, reputable breeder dogs don't end up in shelters. Because... If anything were to ever happen to me and Jamie and we had to get rid of Kira for some reason, Kira would go straight back to her breeder. Same with Memphis. And they would do their best to either find her a new home or keep her. Which, as crazy as it is, actually happened with Kira's sister. We almost ended up with Kira's sister because she ended up going back to the breeder. So that's my opinion on that. Adopt or shop. I got dog hair all over my computer. Katie, thank you for the super chat. Rosa, just wanted you to know I appreciate you sharing your lives with us. I love your girls and your videos bring me joy every day. Aw, thank you so much. Here, go that way. We, we can't, we can't stand right here. You gotta go that way. <laughs> you can't go under the desk right now. You can't. Ugh. She's like, but I could go under the desk right now. Doggy Vlogs, hi, love you guys. Please say hi to me. Hi. Okay, hold on. Hold on. Dog spit dripped on the on the touch screen, so now the touch screen is freaking out. Let me check here. Stephanie Bender, thank you for the super chat. Samuel Stewart, hi. Jess, Memphis, and Kira, bring back Fan Friday. I know, I should. Katie M, thank you for the super chat. Uh, oh, was that, Mo was that Mouse Queen? Look at that. Hey, fluffy butt, go that way. Uh, Mouse Queen, super duper chat for you guys. Keep doing what you do. Wonder if that one artist you shared about earlier does artwork for bunnies. Um, yes, Mouse Queen. Reach out to me, and I will make sure you get her information. She does all animals. Hey, can we go that way? Can we, can we, like, can we, I can't, nobody can see you. Go that way. Go that way. Manning the cameras and the dogs is kind of difficult. I need to build, like, a little box around me so you can't get close to me. What's this? Do you want to do this? Do you want to, do you want to do this? Do we want to make the audience deaf because... A couple people asked for it, and we haven't done it yet. Do you want to sing? Okay, fair warning. The microphone is right here in front of their faces. If they sing, you're going to be deaf. So let me know in the chat. You want to make them sing? Because we can. Is Jamie around? He is downstairs with his cousin. He is helping his cousin build a house, and right now they're designing where the walls and the windows will be going in the house. Craziness, right? Oh, wait, what if we move this over here? Is this better? Oh, look, now you're like in the middle. Uh oh, uh oh, don't fall. Don't fall. Hold on. Right there. There we go. Got this. We got it. Okay, ready? Let's see if we can do it. Okay, ready? Let's go. <gasps> what was that? Ready? Turn your volume to the uh, your regularly scheduled volume, and uh, the audience is now deaf. <laughs> Mouse Queen. <laughs> she wrote the same thing. Does anybody know what movie that's from? It's from a movie. The audience is now deaf. 
Oh, okay. All right, I'm caught up now. Sabrina, thank you for the super chat. My ears hurt, but my soul is happy. Oh, 100%. That's like daily life here. Look at that. You're like, look at you. You're like super, look at, look here, here. You're like, you get to be super up close in the camera. Hi, how are you? How are you? I can't hear now, but that was beautiful. Yeah, I can't hear now either. <laughs> uh, dun, 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 dun. They're really loud. Yeah. See, normally I have my computer sitting to where I can actually turn the volume down on the computer so that if they get really, really loud, I can uh, kind of make it a little quieter. But I can't do that because I'm sitting in the wrong spot. Hold on. That was not cold at all. Okay. <laughs> Super chat from Dan. Uh... <laughs> Super chats are the best way to get your questions answered. Thank you for your support. Your super chat will be answered. Aw, thanks, Dan. Thanks for moderating. Thanks, Dan and, and Steve, Loki the Siberian, for moderating. You guys are great. You're great. Ouch, but it was worth it, right? Right? I love how Kira sings with her little open mouth. Meow, 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 meow. Is that what you do? Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> uh, it's the best. Are you thinking of going dog sledding when winter comes? Well, yeah, of course we are. How can we not, right? See, how can we not go dog sledding when winter comes? Kira does need to get a new harness. I'm hoping to fit her for a harness probably in November so that she'll have one that fits her. Although you could always use Shelby's harness. You're not as big as Shelby, though. She's using Shiloh's harness right now. Well, not like right now, but she's been using Shiloh's harness for now because she's tiny and so was Shiloh. Sabrina, thank you for the super chat. If I go back to this camera, hold on, I've got this, right? Oh, look, now it's like up close dogs. <laughs> uh, dun, 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 Video of Shelby's story. Did I not do a video of Shelby's story yet? I'll have to do that. Doggy vlogs, thank you for the super chat. Kira is sleepy. Yeah, normally after they eat, they kind of take a nap. Well, sometimes we go for a walk. Uh-oh. Did I say that word? Memphis is curled up over on the side over there. She's like, I'm going to curl up over here. Did I feel an earthquake? No. Are you going to get another husky eventually? Do you plan to continue the dog sled saga gameplay? You know, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to do the dog sled saga gameplay or not. Can I put this right here so I feel like I'm not turned away from the microphone? Thanks. Um, I don't know if I'll continue it or not. There's a new dog sledding game called Red Lantern that maybe, maybe the arcade snow dogs makes a comeback when that comes out. Maybe. I'm not promising. Can you bring back Fan Friday? I really should even if i just do it like once a month oh shelby's got a toy mouse queen up up close fluffy yes uh tell memphis and kira i love them hey guys everybody loves you they love you they love you i would wait until she's full, full grown to fit her for a harness that is a nice thought except we need a harness to run this winter so I will probably see if she fits in one of the other dog's harnesses. And if not, I'll order her one and then she'll get another one next year. And actually what I might do is Memphis's harness I got for her when she was only two. So I might get Memphis a new harness and Kira can wear Memphis's harness for this season. We'll see. I haven't figured all that out yet. This is my first stream. Notice me. There you go. <laughs> Pixel Doggy, been watching you guys since 2018. I love you guys. Oh, thanks so much. Somebody down there said they're a new subscriber. Thank you, thank you, thank you. A couple people said hi to Dan. I'm subscribed. I hope you get to 1 million. We're getting there. We're slowly getting there. Uh, dun, 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 dun. What else? Are you doing pumpkins this year? Yes. Are they not considered full grown after a year? No, they actually are about as tall as they're going to get after a year, but they're not really full grown till about two years. And even then they can still fill out a little bit after that. Henry, thank you for the super chat. Is it better to adopt a male or a female dog? Is there really any difference? You know, it really depends on who you ask. A lot of people will tell you that there's a huge difference between male dogs and female dogs. 
The biggest difference is, is that male dogs are normally bigger than female dogs, and male dogs tend to lift their leg to pee. That's about it. I mean, realistically, their personalities are different. I think their personalities matter more than whether or not it's a male or a female. Mouse Queen can't wait to bring the heat tomorrow night for the Dantix Quiz Show. Ha <laughs> ha ha. Yeah, if you guys are into trivia, one of my moderators down here, uh, it, it, it's the Dan Dantix Game Show with RFS Dan. If you guys aren't subscribed to him, you should check him out if you love trivia. Because he does a live stream every Saturday night. Brittany, beautiful song girl, someone should give you... A record deal. Jess, I know that Oakley could say I love you. Do these girls say I love you too? We've really been trying to work with Kira because Kira's a little bit more vocal than Miss Memphis who's over here trying to hide from everybody playing with a toy. What do you got? You got a toy over there? Huh? You got a toy over there? Dun 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 uh, Oh, are you going to see me CB again? I'm going to see me again. Have you ever been to Holland, Michigan? A long time ago. Are they both able to sing in sync? Not really. Can you get them to sing? They just did. I might upload a video. Sabrina, thank you for the super chat. When will your next treat video be? This Friday. So seven days from today, there will be a new treat video. And I'm not sure what it's going to be. It's either going to be peanut butter, what are they called? Macaroons? Macaroons? Or something else. It's probably going to be peanut butter macaroons because I'm not sure what else to make as of right yet. So something like that. Oh, I should have had, I should have my masks in here and I don't have my, my masks in here. All right, you guys hang out with the dogs for a second and I'm going to show you something cool. But you gotta just, you gotta hang out with the dogs for a second. All right, you stay here and you stay here. I'll be right, I'll be right back. Entertain the audience. Tell them all the things and stuff. <laughs> How much you want to bet they chase me to the door? Hold on, go grab it. Look, I found one. Come on, we gotta show them what we got. Okay, so for those of you that don't know, um, most of you know, we do have all kinds of super fun merch. I have Memphis's shirt on. Here, hold on, look up. I don't know which camera we're on. Not that one. Let me change this to this camera. Okay, tilt this up. So, I have Memphis's shirt on. Memphis, I have your shirt on. But check these out! Look how cute they are! Grab it on upside down. Hold on, I got it. It's upside down. <laughs> you burped in my face. I love you so much. Look how cute these are! So, Dan will put a link down in the video description, or in the chat below. These are the new masks you guys asked for. All of you asked for us to make masks, and we did. There's a Kira one, and there is a Memphis one as well, and then there's a couple of them with all the dogs. What, do you want to wear it? Wanna, here, want to wear it? I'll be safe. I'll be safe and mask up. Now you're, now you're Kira. Are you cute? You look dorky. <laughs> You're dorky. You're dorky. Hold on. I got something else for you. I got something else. Then I gotta get back to the chats, okay? I got something else. I made you these before we started streaming. Yeah, I did. I made you these before we started streaming. Hold on. All right. Can you sit? Right here. Sit. All right, let's see. Can I get you to do some tricks? Can you give me your paw? Oh, man. Can you give me that paw? Oh, I, thanks. Okay, ready? Jump. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Don't, don't tip that camera over. We're going to tip this up. So you guys can see that actual Memphis jump. Sit. Sit. All right, ready? Jump. You still jump out of the screen. Sit. Sit. Paw. Yeah, give me that paw. Oh. Thank you, but I was talking to your sister. Give me that paw. Thank you. Okay, all right. Okay, your turn to do some tricks. Okay, Ray, give me your paw. Give me that paw. S sit. Give me your paw. Okay, give me that paw. Okay, give me that paw. Okay, give me that paw. All right, how about the other paw? Oh, <laughs> I knew you were going to get annoyed. All right, sit. Can you turn around? 
Careful. Turn around. You got to turn all the way around. Okay, ready? Turn around. Yeah. Sit. On your butt. Sit. Sit. Ready? There you go. She's like, I'm going on the couch, guys. Oh my gosh, Jenna! <laughs> Every time I click on it. Oh my goodness. Hold on, I broke the thing. Broke the thing. All right. Okay, let me make sure I didn't miss anything while I was grabbing their things. Dun, dun, dun. Brad says, do you use the walkie dog on your bikes? No, I use the Springer. I'm not a fan of the, the walkie dog. Helen says, I had a male husky, he was a big boy, and often people thought he was a Malamute. Thank you for the super chat, by the way. Mouse Queen, if I had the money, I'd try to make it up there for Petcon. Sadly, I'm a poor Texan girl. Someday. Well, you know, Petcon goes from place to place, so maybe eventually it'll be somewhere closer to you. And Heather says, remember me? I'm Heather Pratt's son. She passed away recently. The dogs are doing okay. Aww. Your name sounds really familiar. I'd have to look that up, though. Um, can you turn this way? There you go. There, now lay down. There you go. Christine, thank you for the super chat. Um, so the dogs are using their bully stick holders, the safety chew ones. Isn't that neat? Yeah, there you go. Yeah, lay that way so we don't have to look at your butt. Thanks. Thanks! See how that works? So she can hold her bully stick and chew on it? That's so great. That's so great! Uh, there's a link down below for where you can get those bully stick holders and a coupon code. You get 10% off of them. Those were actually made by a friend of mine, uh, Maya the Husky. Her family made those. And if you don't follow Maya the Mini Husky on Instagram, you totally should. <clears throat> I want to get a German Shepherd and they shed your round. What? Wait, hold on. I want a German Shepherd, and they shed year-round, but from my understanding, Huskies shed about the same. Um, no, Huskies actually shed worse than German Shepherds, but yes, they shed year-round. How do you deal with it? This is always my favorite question that people ask. How do you deal with the dog hair? Um, do you see that vacuum cleaner behind, behind, she behind, behind Shelby, behind Memphis right there? See it hanging on the wall? That's a vacuum cleaner, that um, thing standing up there. We have like five of them. No joke, we have five of them. If you don't believe me, uh, my moderator Dan has been to my house. We do have five of those vacuum cleaners. We just vacuum a lot. Like a lot, a lot. <laughs> uh, I've never been to a live stream before. I've been watching since 2016. Love you, you're so close to a million. So close. Cheesecake for dogs. I do have that written down. I did a test run for Cheesecake for Dogs, and it didn't turn out as well as I wanted it to, but we might have to try it again. Kira's color is pink. What's the vacuum cleaner called? That one is the Dyson V12 Torque Drive. I also have the Dyson V12 Outsize, which is a full canister cordless vac. I have the Dyson I360, which is a robot vacuum. I have a old Dyson that is almost 12 years old now, I think. It's a canister vac. If, if, you, if you haven't figured it out yet, we're a Dyson dog's household here. <laughs> uh, super close to a million. We are less than 24,000 away. Unless it's changed since I looked the last time. Grilled cheese for dogs. <laughs> you should do more live videos. Well, I, I, I need a new webcam because uh, this one is... is is a little sensitive, but maybe. Dun, 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 dun. Petcon in Chicago was canceled. Petcon in LA is supposed to happen in November, but I'm pretty sure that's going to get canceled as well. Dun, 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 dun. Um, somebody asked about the Snow Dogs Vlogs merch. Apparently Teespring didn't like the fact that we had an artist's renditioning of a Jeep on our shirt, so they pulled all of our Merch on that site. Not sure why, but I'll I'll try to fix it. Try. I'll try to. Uh, da, 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 da. Where did you get the couch in your back room? Um, we actually did a whole vlog on that on that futon that um came from the futon shop. 
they sent that to us to do some reviews on, and we absolutely love it. I've never been on a live video. Oh, it's my favorite question in the world. How, how is that not blocked? Dun, 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 dun. Are you ever... Oh, look, it's another one of my favorite questions in the world. Okay, stop getting distracted. Uh, yes, I'm still live. What's inside the snuffle mats? Nothing. The snuffle mats are just for the dogs. Marvelous Mutt. Thanks. Last question. Where do you purchase your crossback harnesses? We've been having so much trouble getting one to Canada. I get them from Alpine Outfitters. If they don't ship to Canada, which I'm not sure if they do, but if they don't ship to Canada, reach out to me. Let me know if you want to get one from there. I can always have it shipped to my house and then I will ship it to you. Mouse Queen Teespring got no chill. Yeah, I went back and forth and back and forth and back and forth with them quite a bit. And I said, it doesn't say Jeep on it. It doesn't say Jeep anywhere. It's like an artist's rendition of a Jeep. And they, uh, they still pulled the merch. So I have to get some new Snow Dogs Vlogs merch designed. Can you make brownies for dogs? I did that a long time ago. Oh, Loki the Siberian says they do ship to Canada. So alpineoutfitters.net is where we get our our urban harnesses and our crossback harnesses from and down in the video description below there's a coupon code that gives you I believe it's 10% off and they're amazing people pixel doggy my second donation I love your TikTok. oh thanks so much our tick our TikTok's doing pretty pretty good I really like it uh. If you want merch from Gone to the Snow Dogs, you can go to shopsnowdogs.com. We do have, I showed it just a little bit ago, we do have a bunch of merch there, including this really cool all-over print Kira shirt that, if it wasn't in the washer, I would have grabbed, but it's in the washer. <laughs> uh. Yeah, so if any of you bought the Jeep merch that was on the Snow Dogs Vlogs Teespring, which if you don't know, that's our vlog channel, uh, apparently you can't get it anymore. Now it's limited edition. <laughs> Uh, my corgi's third birthday is in December, and I kind of want to use one of your dog cake recipes for her. You totally should. Liz, thank you for the super chat. Will you rescue a husky this year? I don't know. I don't know what this year will bring. Dan posted a link to Alpine Outfitters and the coupon code. And yes, the coupon code has to be just like that with the little dash in it. I love your watermelon dog treats. I followed you on TikTok. We do have a TikTok, you guys. You can find us at Gone to the Snow Dogs on TikTok. We're creeping up on a million followers on TikTok as well. Well, we're kind of creeping up. We got like 630,000 on TikTok, but. <laughs> uh, how much do your dogs weigh? Memphis right now is a chunky monkey and she weighs 56 pounds. I'm trying to get her back down to around 52 or 54. That would make me happier. And Kira is 44 pounds. Pop-Tarts for dogs. You guys have requested that a lot, too. That was another one that I really wanted to do. Hey, if I turn this, can we actually see Kira on the couch? Oh, we can. Look, pay attention. Dun, 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 na, 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 na. Is that good stuff? Oh, man. Both of you are just in heaven. Those bully sticks work really well for cleaning their teeth. Somebody said it would be nice to meet the two of you. Man... I really, you know, the Novi Pet Expo is supposed to be happening in November here in Michigan, and I I don't know if it's actually going to happen or not, but I miss the expos. I miss meeting you guys in person at the expos. I hope we can get back to that soon. Oh, we got a Tristan troll. <laughs> oh, what else does it say? Wait, I missed it. Go back. Have you ever been to Memphis, Tennessee? I have been to Memphis, Tennessee. Jamie actually lived in Tennessee for a few years. Oh, I missed it. Are most of your stores reopened? Yes. Dun, 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 dun. So you're a TikTok millionaire almost, sort of. Yes, Mouse Queen, almost, sort of. <laughs> almost, sort of. Uh, do you guys read Harry Potter? Um, I've never read the Harry Potter books. I never have. I think I, I had them at one point in time, but I don't even think I have them anymore. 
I've read parts of them, but I've never read them all the way through. Dun, 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 dun. Churros for dogs. I actually have that written down as well as, um, oh, what are they, what are they called? I can't think of what they're called. The ones that are like rolled up and have the cream in the middle and they're like that Italian, I don't remember what they're called. Not churros. That's all I can think of now. And it's not a chimichanga. <laughs> That's not it. What's it called? Somebody knows what I'm talking about. Oh, I don't know what they are. I think they're an Italian dessert. Whoa, what, what happened? Oh, you dropped your thing. <laughs> uh, how are your niece and nephew? Oh my gosh, they're getting so big. It's crazy. Funny Cat says, Kira's favorite toy foxes are from the Dollar Tree. Yes, I had a bunch of you that responded to that. So, um, or responded to that. Responded to that video. So I'm going to go check there tomorrow. I'm going to try BLTs for dogs. I know, wouldn't that be fun? That would really be fun. Cannolis! Somebody figured it out! Cannolis! <laughs> I bought cannoli things so I could make the cannoli shells. And I have a recipe that I think I really, that will really work for it. So yeah, I was going to make cannolis for dogs. <sighs> Mouse queen, cat in the cake in the chat wants a shout out. <laughs> That's one way to do it. Homemade whimsies. That's a neat idea too. How is Indy? Indy is doing amazing. Dan, <laughs> moderator Dan takes trivia with RFS Dan says, Loki the Siberian, our other amazing moderator says, says, Loki the Siberian and I are dizzy from reading all the chats. Thank you for being awesome in the chat. You guys are awesome. Uh, is, is Shelby named after Shelby country, Shelby County? Uh, kind of. She's named after a Shelby Mustang. She's named after Shelby Mustang. Memphis is named after Memphis Reigns. Can you see the Gone in 60 Seconds theme here? We kind of went off the theme, though, when we named Kira, because Kira is named from Kira the Gelfling from the Dark Crystal. <laughs> uh, do more cooking videos and your dog's daily routine. I have a, a couple routine videos that should be coming up soon. Soon enough. That's not soon enough. Yeah, it's carob. Not chocolate. Carob. Marvelous Mutt. We've tried Alpine Outfitters multiple times, but they keep refunding our money saying our address is invalid. Try calling them on the phone maybe and talking to them. They're really awesome people. Coffee for dogs. I don't think that's a good idea at all. Hey, you dropped your thing. Somebody said bye. Bye. <laughs> uh. Uh, hey, Kira, I love you. Oh, my gosh, it's almost 8 o'clock. So I planned on going until 8 o'clock because Jamie and I have not eaten dinner yet. So the plan was to go for an hour, and holy cow, I can't believe that there's 723 of you in here. Somebody says, where can I get carob? I buy mine from Amazon. You can get them at Whole Foods, or you can get it at Whole Foods, and you can usually get it at any type of, like, natural food store i have a hard time finding it where i'm at but uh i get the i get it from amazon oh wait i saw that where did it go who oh, really saw that question where do you get your bully sticks from um dan will post a link to our kit or there's a link in the video description to our kit and in our kit there's a thing called chew treats for dogs and that's where i get them from if you get these let me see if you get one of these, the safety chew things, um, the bully sticks, when she's done with that, I'll show you. They actually have a hole already drilled through them. So you can buy them with the safety chew. You can buy the bully sticks with the holes already in them. The last time I just bought a big bag of them and Jamie drilled the holes in them for me, which was kind of gross, but, but we, we did it. It was still kind of gross, but we did it. <laughs> can dogs have caffeine? No, no. <laughs> uh, it is almost eight o'clock here in beautiful northern michigan and it's raining so we can't even go for our nightly w-a-l-k <sighs> which sucks <laughs> are memphis and kira related they 
actually are related. You can't even see Kira's face. I didn't realize she was behind the pillow. That's all right. We get we get up close, Memphis. Um, yes, they actually are related. I believe they are. I don't know what it's called. It's like cousins twice removed or something. I'm gonna have to pull out their papers and make a video on that and talk about how they're related and like figure out exactly what they would be called. I think Kira's great grandparents on her mom's side were Memphis's grandparents or something like that. So yeah, they're kind of sort of related. Will Indy be in any of the live streams? Um, maybe someday if Indy's here when we do a live stream, maybe. Now that we have this nice setup, maybe that'll happen. Is that good stuff? Is it delicious? Oh, so my gosh, it's so delicious. I love it. I can't believe you're not done with that yet. Kira's like trying really hard to get the bottom of hers out. And it's just not happening. It's not happening. Oh my gosh, a wild snow dog daddy has appeared. <laughs> here, wait, here we go. There, now you're on the camera. <laughs> I appeared. It's this camera. It's that one. Yeah. Yep. I was watching. Where's Jamie? Where's Jamie? <laughs> and there he is. Hey, poof, here. There he is. I was watching you chew and it. It's getting kind of small, but I like how you're getting both sides of your teeth clean. Uh huh. <laughs> Kira's got hers. I think hers is gone. Yeah. Loki says, always fun hanging out with everyone. So glad everyone t came. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Loki, for moderating the chat. Loki the Siberian, you guys, if you if you haven't checked out his channel yet, you definitely should. Heather says, one of my dogs ate some bacon wrapped shrimp. Oh my goodness. Bacon wrapped bacon wrapped shrimp. That Why'd you good. give it to the dog? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see. pet you right now because you're eating. You're well eating you mad. can. You can just show everybody what she does. She won't she I was. She didn't get super mad. Oh. You can tell. Everybody says hi, hi Jamie. Hi. Hi, Jamie. Oh, Kira, you're like gone gone. Yeah. Mm. She's trying. You know, She's really fighting yeah, get, for it. Get them front teeth clean. Yeah, get that <laughs> in there. Yeah. I fed them their dinner. Did you see? I fed them their dinner on the snuffle mats. Uh, no, I must have been not paying attention. Playing ping pong. Yeah. I could hear the ball. Yeah. Ping pong. We weren't ping. just. Is that why they call it ping pong? Probably. Ping pong. Ping pong. Ping pong. Ping pong. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sabrina, thank you for the super chat. Are you as hungry as I am? I'm hungry. Oh, the dogs okay. already ate. Everybody says hi. It's all rainy. Jamie. It is all rainy. Actually, it kind of cleared up. We might actually get a... a W-A-L-K-N? We might, yep. Sweet. With a good sunset. And it oh, cooled, sweet. I'm and good. it cooled off. I'm game. But I'm still hungry. Yeah, me too. We got to <laughs> eat first. Sarah says, hello, yeah. Jess and Jamie and Kira. Hope you guys have a great weekend. Love you guys. Thank you, Sarah. Sarah. Heather says, I didn't give it to them. They snuck in and got it. Oh, my goodness. She's like, how about you just hold it for me and I'll, I'll just, I'll keep trying. I'll, I'll keep trying. When are you guys going camping again? Next week. We're going camping next week. I'm going to end the stream after the dogs are done eating their bully sticks. Uh-oh. That's soon. I know. Well, I only wanted to go for an hour, and I'm starving. Yeah. <laughs> are you live? Yes, I'm live. Almost, almost. Why isn't Jamie in the videos anymore? Are you not Jamie? You gotta hold it on your own. Uh, is it Friday already? Is that gone? Huh? Is that gone? No, you still have more than her. She does. I gotta take from one it? of them and show people the hole in the bottom of it, though. Oh, here. Can, can I have your pacifier? She's like, no. <laughs> Her feet are all dirty. Right before we live streamed, I let them outside, and she ran straight for the hole. The hole, man. Yeah. Damn. I'm like, oh, of course. Of the course. White. Yeah, right. Well, they both have white. Oh, yeah. I got to read you this super you. chat. We got a $200 super chat from Jenna. It says, you and Jamie and the girls have been a gift to us during these wild times. Glad to be in a position to give back a bit. Did you hear that? I did. I read that earlier. Oh, did, as you say, did you hear it earlier? Yeah, oh, wait, I got sure. a couple more yeah. super chats I got to not miss. Yeah. Maddie says, I grew up with huskies also. Do you guys have any other pets besides huskies? Nope, just huskies. 
Christine says, hi, Jess and Jamie. Did Kira like the glow-in-the-dark ball? Yes. She likes playing with it outside. You see? You still got a little piece here? She she's sure gonna does. Come, she's going to come right for you. She's like, no, don't take it. Are you going to take, are you going to? Are you going to show them? No. She's like, guys, I'm not done with this. I'm not done. I think both of them have to, have to be done. Yeah, because I think you're going for the wrong side. And there's nothing sticking out there. Okay, you got the right side. <laughs> Don't judge me, Dad. She's Don't judge right me. She's got the right side. She's got the right side. Don't judge me. Okay, can I have this? Yeah, I think that's it. Thank that's, you. That's, uh, okay, yeah. let's see. All right, so yeah. I'll show you. There's a little stick here. Is that around the camera? Yeah, I think so, yeah. There's a little stick yep. there, and you push this, and this little white stick comes out. Bloop. Uh, no. 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 Ew, it's so gross. Yeah, we usually do that right over the trash yeah. can. Hey, so. no, we can't have that. That's okay. the part you can choke on. So I don't know if you can see it's it, all gone. but there's actually a hole in the middle of that. <gasps> can I have a paper towel? Yeah, I don't know why you put that in my hand. <laughs> if I had to do it, you had to do it. <laughs> uh, are they hard chewers? Yes. What's a super chat? That's the little things you see lighting up at the top of the chat. Don't lick my hand. That's gross. Katie says, Abby loves to read as much about Huskies. What's the what's your favorite book on your shelf? Oh, on my shelf? The Cruelest Miles. I don't know how old Abby is, but that might not be a book for kids. Um, I don't know. Thank you. I'm going to have to uh, go through some of the books on my shelf. I have a My Little Pony art book over there. Was that good? Yeah. Okay, all right. We're going to go ahead and call it, you guys. Thank you for coming and joining us. Thank you to my amazing moderators. If you have not checked them out yet, Loki the Siberian, go check out his channel. Uh, he does a lot with running his Huskies. He has very active Huskies. And then my friend Dan, Dan Ticks Trivia with RFS Dan. If you love trivia, go check him out. If you think he should do a Snow Dogs trivia, let him know. Nobody wants to see your butt, but they want to see that foxtail. <laughs> So thank you guys. I am going to try to start doing live streams more often now that I have this office set up to do this. So thanks, you guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive. Dream big. And we will see you again soon. Bye. Bye, guys. Can we paw? See you later. Goodbye. <laughs>